Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can download and install Atom IDE on your Windows 10 machine. So Atom IDE is a text editor used to write programming languages such as Java, Python, PHP, etc. So Atom is very popular among web developers. So web developer use Atom IDE to build their web application. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can download and install the software and how you can add more functionality on Atom IDE. For that, open your favorite browser. So I'm using Google Chrome. In Google Chrome, search for Atom. Open this link, atom.io. So don't worry about the link. Link will be on the description box. So Atom IDE is a text editor built by GitHub. So if you don't know about GitHub, GitHub is an online repository where you can store your source code and you can share your source code with others. And in this website, you will find all the documentation regarding Atom IDE. For now, we are not going through the documentary. We are just going to download Atom IDE. For that, here you will find download option. So if you are using other operating system, it will automatically detect your operating system and you can download the Atom file. So for now, I have Windows 10 64 bit. So I'll just click on this download option. So it is downloading and it is around 140 MB. So it will take some time after completing the download. I will show you how you can install the software. So the download has been completed. So to install Atom, just click on the file. So here Atom is installing. So let me minimize my browser. So you don't need to click anything. When you open your file, it will automatically going to install your file and it will automatically launch your Atom IDE when the installation is being completed. So here the Atom IDE is installing. So here we have Atom IDE. So first time when you open Atom IDE, it will ask you to register a default Atom URL handler. Just click on yes. So let me maximize the window. So this is our welcome page. And here we have our welcome guide. So with Atom IDE, we can open our existing project or we can connect with our Git and GitHub for vision control. And you can also install some packages and plugins to add some more functionality on your Atom IDE. And you can also customize look and theme of your Atom IDE by just clicking on this choose a theme option and by clicking on this customize the styling. You can customize your Atom theme. So for now, I'm going to be showing you how you can install packages on Atom ID. So to install packages on Atom ID, you can click on this install package option. So here you will find open installer. So by just clicking this open installer, it will open you the installer page from where you can install packages on your Atom ID. So here are the different packages you can install on your Atom ID. There is another way of installing packages. Say for example, when you open Atom ID, you don't have any tabs. So I will just close all this tab and I will show you how you can install packages. For that, just press Ctrl Shift P. So it will open this search window and search for installer package. So here, let me write installer, open this install packages and themes. So from here, we can install packages on our Atom ID. So here are the featured packages which you can install on your Atom ID. For now, I'm not going to install these packages. I'm going to search for a package. Say for example, I want syntax highlighter. Then I will search for syntax highlighter. So here let me search for syntax highlighter. Then hit enter. So here you can see that syntax highlighter is searching. So here we find different highlighters. Say for example, I want to install this package Atom syntax highlighter. So if you want to know more about package then just click on the package and here you will find some documentation about that package and if you want to install the package then you can click on this install option for now i'm not going to install the packages so let me show you some more features so from here you can update your atom id and from here you can install themes on your atom id so if you want to know which packages and which themes are installed on your atom id just click on this packages and here you will find all the packages and themes which are installed in your Atom ID. So these are the packages and these are the themes installed in your Atom ID. So let me show you how you can do coding on your Atom ID. 
for that let me close this setting option then go to file then click on new file and here you can start doing some code so let me do some HTML code say for example HTML and here let me close this HTML tag and here let me write head tag here let me write closing tag and here let me write title let me close this title tag and here let me give some title say for example my first atom id and here let me write body tag and here let me close this body tag and let me write one paragraph and here i'm just going to close this paragraph and here i'm just going to write welcome to atom id so now to save the file just click on file then click on save so let me save it on my desktop first dot html so to save any file you have to write the file extension so this is html that's why here i'm using html extension if you are writing javascript then you have to use javascript extension then click on save so when you save the file with extension of that programming language it will automatically highlight your syntax so if you want to know more about html then i had already created a playlist on html5 so the playlist link will be on the description box or it will be on the i button so this way you can install atom id and you can use atom id on your windows 10 machine so that's it for this video thanks for watching if you like this video don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more programming videos like this bye for now see you next video